So in winter time the travellers would need to keep warm. So a lot of them made like a, like a TP type structure and on the opening of the of the bow tent and sometimes they had a bow tent at the other side so there would be a bow tent and a tunnel like structure and then another bow tent and in the tunnel like structure they would build a fire that's where the fire would go now if you only had one bow tent and you didn't have your wood stove because some of these camps get uh, sort of raided and people would damage their stuff and maybe break our, the stove they made they'd maybe break that up so maybe this was the only other way they could make a fire in their shelter so like I say it's like a TP structure that would be wrapped in canvas uh, up to about here up to about there, it would maybe be bigger than that uh, I'm just going with what I think and if it was a proper TP structure it would have a liner in it so a T, as you know a TP the outer skin is about 4 inches off the ground to let air under it and then you've got a liner that is on the ground so that the air will come in and go up, up the liner and take the smoke out out the top and I suppose that would work uh, but this sort of idea I don't know if they actually put a liner in it or whatever they've done they probably didn't uh, but that's an idea I'd like to try once I set the tent up uh, see if it works obviously in a tent a small fire is adequate uh, you don't want a big fire because it would be just too hot I mean, I've had canvas tents with wood burners on it and you've really got to keep the fire kind of to a minimum or, it, or you just get too hot and you've got to get out of the tent so a small fire with a canvas uh, wrapped TP style chimney and then this would be, you'd be inside the boat tent here looking out so that would be your, your end your end uh, ribs and the fire would be there as long as you've got enough space that the flames only going to touch the canvas you should be okay and oh, these back bits would reflect the heat back into the tunnel of the, the bow tent so I'd like to try that out and see how it works and obviously th this whole structure would be wrapped in canvas and it would probably drape on top here yeah. I think if you got two 12 by 9 uh, painters tarps that would be plenty just to try that out and obviously the, the back bit would now be your door so that would be your back that would be the front uh, but I'm going to measure that to see how how wide it is uh, to see what sort of tarp would fit around that because you'd want to make that, that bit as big as possible uh, without being too big ok that measures uh, 15 foot that's a wee bit high up you want it a wee bit lower so I'll say about a 16 foot length uh, obviously the further you go up the, the less you need uh, but if you had a, a 15 foot length to cover the bottom but if you and you could put a liner in there uh, which would make it work a lot better so you can work it out from there, what you'd need.